Hey folks, JP, Mocha Wesman, coming at you again from the hardwoods. Wow, twice in uh, one week. It's been a while since I've been uh, out here doing this kind of stuff, so obviously no videos have been coming out. And last oh, year or so, I have been out here doing that. I've rarely filmed, so this is what it is. It is what it is, but uh, it is Saturday. June 5th, I'm out here. I uh, got out here about 12.30, it's um, two o'clock right now. Got camp set, and we are going to enjoy the rest of the evening. Got dog with me, he's off somewhere, exploring. And uh, we're going to get some wood going here pretty soon because I've got a little bit left, but uh, obviously enough for dinner and breakfast, which is the only two meals I'm cooking. So obviously enough for that, but Maybe a nice have a little fire going tonight. Obviously, I don't need anything rip roaring. But just something to keep the boogeyman away. All right, there she be. It's going to be home for the night. Threw the tarp up over this uh, frame I put up last year. Out here at my Four Corner Station camp. So. That's where we're gonna lay our heads tonight, me and the dogs. So I don't really have any plans for this trip, any big projects going on or anything. It was just about getting back out here because on Memorial Day when I did that hike, uh, that was awesome. That was awesome getting back out here and enjoying it and enjoying the woods and just taking it easy. Uh, I felt really good afterwards, really calm, and I needed it. You know, stresses of life and work and all that. All winter long, I kept thinking, I can't wait till spring. I'm gonna get out in the woods and do some uh, photography and do some uh, you know, foraging, work on my wild edible skills, all that good stuff, and I didn't do any of it. You know, spring just flew by. Uh, I think a lot of times we get into the habit of making the excuse that we're too busy. Too busy for that, too busy for this. And that may be the case on occasion, but more than more often than not, that's just a convenient lie we tell ourselves so that we don't feel bad about not doing the things we know we want to do and should do and can do. Uh, you know, it goes back to, you know, technology and all that, all that jazz. How much time do you spend on your phone? Uh, how much time do you spend watching TV? All that. Personally, I don't watch TV. We don't have cable or anything like that, rarely. Uh, if I watch anything, it's on YouTube. But, you know, there's other, there's other uh, social media apps, you know, Facebook, Instagram, stuff like that, that I catch myself spending more time on than I should, for sure. Uh, I think they say the average person spends four hours a day on their phone, not doing, like, work or anything, but just, you know, doing the social medias and stuff like that. You know, you figure that's, you know, 28 hours a week. It adds up. Ah, it's cold! It's cold. Oh, Ooh. it's cold. <laughs> Easy. Get oh. the paws out for me. Ah. Woo! It's cold, Finner. It's cold, buddy. Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh, it ain't so bad once you're in it. We're getting in it. That is cold. Well, folks, that was a rather good way to cool off. The dog's still running around here somewhere. Whew, that was some cold water. It was so bad once you got under, but man, it's cold. Cold getting in. Probably about time to head back to camp, get a little fire going, and uh, work on some supper and unwind a little bit. I sit here having a little mini cigar. Ah, uh, just listen to the crick sing.
I got that little bundle I made earlier. It's still right here. So it ain't very big, but it's big enough. Because I knew it rained quite a bit lately. Wasn't sure how good a tender I could find. I didn't really have a lot at the house, but what I did have was uh, bunch of birch bark I gathered up in Michigan last October bunch of it so figure with that and whatever tinder bundle I could scavenge I'd be all right I was able to get a nice little tinder bundle so now we're going to get some flame going longer than I expected but it took it always gets me. Won't be long now, Phineas. Have some good coals and Get us a good dinner. What do you think, bud? All right, all right, all right. Looks like we get down to some good coals. I can't wait any longer anyway. Coals or no coals. It is time. Let's get some food on the grill. Throw a little bacon in the skillet first. Part one of what's gonna be this delicious meal. Bacon. Here you go. There you go. It's hot. Be careful. I'm gonna drop it in with the beans. Oh boy, does this smell good? That little bit saucy. We know, Phineas. Yeah, buddy. Got a little sausage there for you. Oh, that's right. There's the masterpiece. Some beans, some bacon, and some sausage. Mm, it's gonna eat good. Oh, talk about hitting the spot. Talk about hitting the spot. And are you looking at me like you haven't ate in three days? And we all know that ain't true. Well, folks, I'm just gonna watch this fire burn down a bit. Right hit the rack. What will you say, Finn? Yeah, you've been trying to climb in that bed for the last half hour, haven't you? It's gonna be about that time, huh? Tuckered out. Both of us, I think. Come over here. Come on. Yeah, there's my boy. Both a little tuckered out, ain't we, Finn? Uh, morning, folks. There's the old Finn dog. Got a little limp this morning. Got a little limp on his left front paw. I checked it for thorns, nothing. 
Just played hard yesterday, huh, buddy? Maybe bumped it a little too much. Uh, well. Slept about as expected. <clears throat> Off and on throughout the night. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely ain't like the king bed at home, but. Got all those beautiful mornings, the birds chirping. Coffee. We well, you know, old son. I know that paw's hurting you, isn't it? Paw's hurting you, old boy. Tell everybody in YouTube land we had bacon and eggs for breakfast. You had your fair share, huh? Spoiled. Rotten. Spoiled rotten dog, aren't you? Yeah, now we're gonna pack up camp and just get everything cleaned up. Probably call it a day. Maybe hike around a little bit. A few things I still wanna do, see. Come up with some good ideas for some projects here at the camp. Uh, one being I gotta fix the uh, sawhorse, gotta fix the wood cutting station. Um, and I think nice little camp table is in order. Nice little camp tables in order, so got a couple projects to work on next time. Oh, firewood. We need more firewood, too. But that's probably going to do it for this video, so appreciate everybody watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.